Our study is about the role of population change in future energy use and greenhouse gas emissions. There are a number of things that contribute to energy use and emissions, uh, but we have not, uh, we don't know that much about the independent effect of, of population separate from other factors. So our study was about looking at population changes like population growth, aging, and urbanization and what they may, may mean for future emissions. Our findings were that uh, population changes can really matter to emissions. Population growth, for example, uh, is an important contributor to emissions and we found that if w the world followed a slower population growth path, it could contribute significantly to the emissions reductions that some consider necessary to avoid serious climate change impacts. Uh, so in other words, we found that slowing population growth would not solve the climate change problem, but it could make a contribution uh, along with other approaches. We also found that other kinds of population change, like aging and urbanization, can significantly affect emissions as well in particular parts of the world. This is important for two reasons. The first one is that it's beneficial to addressing the climate change issue to understand better the scale of the problem. So the more we understand about how fast emissions may grow uh, in the future, the better prepared we will be to address that challenge. Understanding how demography may affect emissions helps us understand better the potential growth of emissions in the future. Second, there are a number of factors that affect emissions. Population is one of those. And there are a number of different policy approaches that are under discussion and debate for how best to respond to a climate change issue. And this study can help inform that debate by quantifying uh, the influence that population changes could have on emissions.